The secret is often left out when we discuss the rizq from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. When we discuss the sustenance from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And that secret is the secret of being economical. It is no secret from a financial perspective, but it is a secret from a religious perspective. Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala increases the rizq of a person who does what? Who is economical in the way he, in the way he spends. And who understands how much money he or she has and spends only according to the means that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has provided this person. And to this effect, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Quran, Allah says, لِيُنْفِقْ ذُو سَعَةٍ مِّن سَعَةٍ Let the person who has sa'a, let the person who has loads and loads of money, okay? The person who has enough money, ample money, you know, all of those things are well worked out for him. Let that person spend in accordance to the amount of money that he has. وَمَنْ قُدِرَ عَلَيْهِ رِزْقُهُ And whoever doesn't have that, rather the person has a very tight budget that he's working with, then let him spend from only the tightness that he can afford. That's it. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, then he continues and he says, سَيَجَعَلُ اللَّهُ بَعْدَ عُسْرٍ يُسْرَ Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will do what? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will then after a difficult time that this individual was going through, but he lived in within his means, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will make ease after the difficult time that he's living through. 